What's up guys, the April Patreon rewards are now available. Armageddon, Teferi Time Reveler, and Nekusar the Mind Razor are all available through the end of the month. If you'd like to support our channel and pick up these sweet proxies, you can do so at patreon.com slash itresolves or clicking the link in the description below. What is up everybody, welcome to part two uh, with this Jeskai Winota deck list. Uh, this is a very sweet deck. If you did not already see part one, I highly recommend you do so. Uh, you can get a better idea of what cards are in this list. This is Hoagland's deck list, not mine, um, but it's very, very, very good. Uh, so far, I am loving it. Um, this is like a really good hand if we just draw lands, but I don't think we can keep that. Um, yeah, we can keep this. I'm gonna put this on the bottom. We'll get the tri land out first. This is a much more powerful hand for sure, or one that we can at least utilize. Um, that's a good draw. Uh, let's do this. Let's do this and let's scry here. Uh, let's just make sure that we're gonna be hitting our land drops because that is obviously very crucial for us. Yep. Very glad we did that. We will get the Legion War boss out next turn if need be. Um, but after that, the it's a little up in the air, we will say. Oh, this is the cycling deck. Okay, well, that's an interesting one. Um, yeah, let's do this. Let's do this. Perfectly happy to trade these off. <laughs> if they were willing to um, solely because that cycler does get out of hand if you just continuously cycle a bunch of stuff so I'm all for it really kind of hoping we draw an untapped land by the way here that'd be good um, I was up against a deck like this uh, in a recent video actually I think it was a recent video they kind of literally just scried a lot or excuse me just cycled a lot it wasn't really all that exciting of a of a deck if I'm gonna be honest um, maybe that's an incorrect assessment, I don't know, but I'm kind of all too happy to, to trade any of these guys off, so, like, that's fine. I mean, we'd take a big hit here on the backswing with the three ones. It's a six, six point swing, but, I mean, it's kind of okay. pretty good it's a cool deck working a lot better than the the first iteration that I saw at least okay so let's charming Prince again sure thankfully we are in a go wide deck as well kind of here so that actually works out for us um i'm just gonna scry two here we don't really want either of those we really want winota now um i'm gonna leave up the raise the alarm uh yeah let's do that interesting deck this like I said I've seen like one of these decks before so yeah I feel like this deck either really really works or it really really doesn't this is a case where it's definitely working uh, which is awesome on the opponent side so good for them kind of want them to attack in here they're not gonna Dang. Okay, well, let's raise the alarm. Agent of Treachery, huh? Well, that's not gonna do it. Um... This has to attack. I mean, we can 
swing in with this, but I don't think we actually want to. I'm only going to attack with this. I think we should just be holding up for, you know, the potential Winota. So I'm happy to just kind of let that do its thing. I'm assuming they've got some kind of like, hey, make all my dudes bigger. I feel like they have to. Um, I know there is a combat trick with cycling that does that, so that's kind of my assumption. Um, and like, that's good, but we also do have quite a bit of blockers here. Um, we're going to continue to scry here. We really just want to get to the Winota. Uh, if we can get there, then I think we are at least okay. Surprising to me that they just keep blocking with that. Like, if we had a Bone Crusher Giant or anything, we would have used it on the healer already. So I don't know why they're not just blocking with the healer and not losing a creature. But, you know, hey, you do you. Land does get us one, you know, closer to the Agent of Treachery, which is, like, fine. It's not great, but, like, it's something, I guess. Uh, yeah, I mean, one more land and we've got Agent of Treachery and we just kind of steal one of their enablers here. Chandra. Okay. Well, Chandra's not bad. Kind of just gives an, an excuse to swing in, but, um... Yeah, I mean... And again, like, I don't know why they're not just blocking with the 2-2. Just don't lose your creature. Obviously, we would have burned it if we could. So, like, I don't, I don't fully understand. Can you kill the guard mage? I don't, I mean, that would suck and all, but, like, I don't care that much. <laughs> okay. You kill Chandra, that's cool. Off, Chandra. I'm gonna cycle this. What do we bone crusher here? I'm assuming they have like a fight as one or something along those lines. Um Like I think we just hit the life gain guy. I don't, I don't really know. Cool. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, I'm just going to start getting in there with this guy. Now that this guy doesn't have a 2-2 to block, he's not going to be blocking. Like, he's just going to swing. So, you know. Like, it's cool. You get a card draw plus three tokens. Like, that's solid value do not get me wrong but like i'm just gonna age in a treasury <laughs> I, like i'm just gonna steal this I, it just seems like the thing to do um i do see okay to be fair i do see there being a case where this could be exceptionally good when it's like when it's up against... Oh, I should have attacked with the Guard Mage. Whoops. Uh, do not mean to prolong this game any longer than it needs to. But I, I see this being good against a deck where there's just, like, not much board interaction. Um, but, like, most decks are prepared to, like, wipe a board. Or they have reasons not to wipe it. And it's usually because they also have, like, a really good board. So I don't think this deck is substantially better than uh, some of the other aggro decks, I will say. Now we get two tokens. I'm just going to swing with these. We could swing with all of these, too, if we really wanted to. Probably would make sense, too. I'm kind of playing it really slow, partially because I just want to get to a Winota and have all of these triggered. <laughs> 
not all of them because not all of them are non-human but like a lot of these are gonna trigger it which is gonna be pretty cool um oh okay cool yeah i mean that's pretty dang good that's trample and haste Guys, it might happen. Okay. Um, okay. We're just going to do this. We keep it simple. We do have to leave up some, some substantial blockers here. So that's fine. All right, let's do it. Let's do the thing. Is this game one, by the way? I'm losing track. Okay, all right, are we ready? Cause we're just gonna hit the attack all button. Oh, did it, did it kill the Winota? Well, dang, now we're not gonna hit the attack all button. Um. Yeah, okay, well, we're just gonna swing in with these then. Dang it. We need another Winota. Um, <laughs> but, like, my thing is, like, this isn't... Like, this is fine. They can attack in with it. But, like, we technically can kill it pretty easily. We just block a lot. <laughs> like, do it. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. I will 100% block it. I do not care. I will throw away so many cards for that. Oh, 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 there we go. Okay. All right. Let's do that, that, that. Let's keep it going. <laughs> this is the slowest game in the world, guys. I'm very sorry. I could attack all, and I could count it up, and I could potentially beat them. But I don't know that, and I'm lazy to count. So, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Yeah, I mean, maybe. Now, definitely not, but, like... Whoops. Like... I mean, I guess I'll just attack with these guys, too. I... I don't know. Oh, I, sh <laughs> I keep forgetting to attack with the Guard Mage, guys. I'm sorry. I'm just kind of trying to whittle them down, though. Like, they keep gaining life with um, the Zenith Fire, which is a sweet card. Um, but, like, I don't know. This this doesn't seem to be doing it, is all I'm saying. <clears throat> and they are so unwilling to, to do much here. Yep. This game is just so long. It's ridiculous. Sure. You have a million lands. You can do whatever. I'm assuming they're saving like another fire or something. Okay, well, this seems kind of good because we can just flicker our agent. And then we just steal their 8 8. So now they have to do something about this if they can. Because if we steal their 8-8, eight, eight, they definitely just lose. Like, there is no way they don't. But, I'm sure they are saving their Zenith Flare, which I'm assuming they have, for the next Winota. So, like, you got a trade-off. But this definitely loses you the game if you don't... Yeah, there you go. <clears throat> Makes sense. I just... This is so slow. Zenith Flare keeps them in the game for so long. <laughs> they have used three of them. Am I wrong? No, I am correct. They have lost three. So I got one more predictably in their deck. This game. Oh, well, okay. 
I can I can has win. Okay. Guys, normally I try not to to say bad words in this, but fuck it. <laughs> like we're just attacking all. Alright. Um I think that was game one, so we're gonna continue on and do two more. Honestly, I don't remember at this point. I've been playing a lot of games of magic, guys. Um which is fun. I love it. Uh, but by contrast, that game took about as long as the first video with this deck. If that puts things in perspective for you. Yep, I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna keep. Let's... Yeah, let's just try land here. Potentially we could have just Temple of Triumph there just to get the scry. Um... And we, like, we've got our fixing, so we didn't really need the try land, but I'm going to do this. Yeah, let's do that. And let's pass them. We'll see what they do. Depending on what they do, we'll either raise the alarm or bone crusher giant. Bone crusher makes a lot of sense, because then we can just kind of bone crusher this then play the Bone Crusher, and then they've got like a, a decent threat that they need to deal with. This may be a Boros Winota deck, to be fair. In which case, I'm glad I was able to take that card out. Um, whoops. Yeah, let's just do this, and let's play this. Uh, I'm playing this over the Raise the Alarm because they are red-white. My assumption is they've got, you know, plenty of ways to, to kill stuff like this. Wow, Krinko. Okay. Well, that's cool. Uh, we're going to pay two. We're going to do this. We're going to do this. Do we just gain three? Yeah, I, I think I'm just going to gain three. We're against an aggro deck, so like... And hey, they may have Winota here, I don't know. I don't want to get on and create that number. Okay. Krinko is a cool include. My assumption is that this is definitely a Winota deck, because I don't see why you would ever run Krinko in like just a regular kind of aggro deck, but hey, I, I could be wrong. I mean, I'm gonna do this. I'm sure they can kill it, but like, I'd rather get this off the board. Sure. Now we don't have a Krinko to deal with, so like, I'm kind of fine with that. And we drew a Chandra, which is quite good. Um. I'm going to say no, only because we have these agents in our hand. It might be worth it just to try and get to that mana. Um, let's do this. Let's do this. We're in kill them as fast as we can mode. Yes, they can swing back at Chandra. No, I don't particularly care. Um, we also have the Charming Prince to gain us a little bit more life or just scry. Uh, next turn... You know, we've got this into this, or however, whatever we draw, we'll see, but yeah, it looks like they're going to attack Chandra. They might be able to kill this with, like, a Bone Crusher, or they may just play their Bone Crusher. Oh, okay, sure. I'm going to do this. I'm going to scry to you. Ooh. Yes, please. Um, wait, 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 wait. We want this. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, end turn. End of their turn. We raise the alarm. Hopefully we swing in with Winota for butt tons of damage. Is the plan. Worth noting, we kind of have lethal already. Oh, perfect. 
Perfect. That's all we needed. That's all we needed. That was perfect. Thank you. Thank you, opponent. Please let us actually do this. Yes. Okay, well, we failed to find. That sucks. But it's fine. Everything's fine. <laughs> oh. Oh. Yes. Sure. Why not? <laughs> there we go. We got it. We got it. That was a cool game. Um, unfortunately, they were stuck on lands. Worth noting that, you know, that, that had a big impact on the game. Uh, so glad we have raised the alarm in this deck. That was sweet. Uh, cool. Last game, guys. Uh, feeling good with this deck. I love this one. Um, this is another favorite of mine, I think. The the last one that we played today, uh, the whatever it is, reanimator, like, bant kind of thing. I love that deck. Like, that's the deck I think I would just play normally. Um, uh, we're short, but I'm going to try it. Um, we have a Skyland. Everything's fine. We don't, we don't need you. We got one right we, we just need land um we'll see what the opponent does uh i like having bone crusher giant when we're on the play here that's kind of nice uh, especially with a raise the alarm in the hand just so we can kind of pick and choose which one we need to do that is not a land okay let's see what you gonna do I'm gonna raise the alarm oh oh thank you Thank you so much. Oh, just makes me so happy. Okay, let's let's do it. Let's swing for four. Beautiful. Couldn't have asked for a better draw. Uh, yeah, we really. <clears throat> I'm trying to think what we need. Literally, just a land is what we need. Nothing else. Cool. You you beanstalk giant all you want. Oh my goodness, we are. So lucky. Let's do it. Let's all attack. Let's get four triggers on the boat. Yes. Perfect. Uh, let's cry to Um, you. Yeah, well, this is going to get sense. Yeah, let's do this. We want Agent of Treachery. We're just going to steal their land. <laughs> we're just, just going to take this. <laughs> um, we'll take your try land. Just because. Wow, we failed to find so often. Okay, that kind of sucked. But we did steal their land. So I feel pretty good about that. Aw, sad day. Um, Right? Right? That's what we do, I think. One, two, three, four, five, six. If we draw a land, we just get to agent and steal whatever they play. I think that's what we do. I mean, that's what we did. Cool. All right, guys. This deck is ridiculous. Okay, so uh, that's an easy three wins there. I won't say easy. That's a clean three wins. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. This deck is sweet. If you have not played this deck, very, very good list, uh, by Hoagland. Absolutely fantastic. Highly, highly recommend playing this one. Uh, this is much better than the Boros list that I came up with. Um, so don't listen to me. Listen to other people that build decks is my advice. Uh, anyway, guys, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed it, uh, make sure to leave a like or a comment down below. Always make sure to subscribe if you are not already. I know a lot of you are not, but I certainly appreciate you just watching uh, and taking part in these videos. It means a lot. So thank you guys so much. Hopefully you enjoyed it. I will see you in the next gameplay video.